Hi, I'm John Orkut. I'm a scientist and uh, professor of geophysics at the Scripps Institute of Oceanography at UCSD. The work we're doing now really differs a lot from the things that we've done for the past decades and even centuries. We've gone to sea in ships. problem with ships is they go to one place for a short period of time to make observations that are relevant to some aspect of oceanography. The problem arises in that it's a very poor way to collect or understand change. In things like climate that change very, very slowly, it's obviously important to make these kinds of observations over a very long period of time. A climate cycle probably happens in every 25 or 30 years. When we do go to sea with our individual instruments, we tend to bring the instruments back. They probably are recording internally. We extract the data, we put them on disk drives and files. Sometimes we actually get them to some kind of a national archive where they're kept for a long period of time. And scientists later come to those data and draw them out in the form of files and do their analyses on the files themselves. So what we're doing with the cyber infrastructure because the data are coming back in near real time with very short latencies. We're making the data universally available. They're open to anyone that wants to use them. They can collect these data streams and do what they would like to do with them. We're really looking at changing the way oceanography um, actually works and how it's done from the rather small, rather limited programs that we have today to much, much larger, uh, more synoptic. Just the planet.